Well hello and welcome to another video from the Computer Techie and uh, we are going to be learning how to reset a Cisco router from Roman and also within well if you've already got access, enable access to the router then you can do it also from the commands that today so it's just slightly different we'll start off with um, the one if you already have enable access first just because that's slightly quicker um, so if you already have an enable access first then you probably know how to get to your router through the console cable and whatever you so you want to log in and come into um, configuration mode if I can type correctly and you want to do this uh, configuration that and then with this X thing here like that and then you just want to um, copy copy what you just did and then reload what I just did there, the copy run start thing is the short version of the copy running configuration, startup configuration um, command. And then the the root will reload and we'll see we're into the um, initial configuration prompt. I'll pause it here because everyone knows what this looks like and it, just, it takes a little bit of time so I'm going to pause it and then we'll come back okay so there we are it's prompted us to for a uh, initial configuration dialog so that shows that the config has now reset itself it's essentially blank and we should just be at router there we go that's it. So now, just to prove the next bit, um, we're going to do it from Roman. So if you can't access your router or you don't know what the login is, maybe it was given to you for, and uh, someone didn't give you the password um, or you've messed something up or you've forgotten the password, this is how you recover your router um, and start again with a new config. Um, so what you want to do is you want to reload the router uh, if you haven't got access then just turn it off and turn it back on again make sure you're connected to PuTTY and then when, when you see it booting you want to right click and then do special command break in putty so I'm going to do that now you need to be fairly fast um, to get the break normally I sit on it like this oh I missed it, missed it break ah got it ok right so now we're at Roman and then these are the commands that you need to do within Roman. It's going to reload again. Okay, and now we're back at our um, initial configuration dialog again. And then what you want to do is you want to go back and then do this bit here. I don't remember if I remember saying that last time. Um, but you always have to, once you've reset your config, you always need to do this bit within configuration mode again and save it. Otherwise, it won't tell the router to... Um, to boot from your config saved in MVRAM, it will just go round in circles asking you to start all over again. So 
So you just copy this. I'm also going to change the description while I'm here. Um, just to prove that uh, it saved it. Save the config, and then if we reload, we'll see that it will reload from our new configuration. This works on some of the switches as well. Um, Unless it's uh, one of the some switches require you to hold down a button, um, some of them like this you can just reset the configs like this without um, actually having to do anything else. I know my uh, thirty-five uh, seventy requires you to hold down the button to reset it. You can't reset it like this. Whereas, for example, the the um, thirty-five hundred XL you can reset it like this so it just depends on your device but generally you can reset every any router so just go router like this and it'll work actually um, the 2960 switches you can reset like this um, so yeah so now we should hopefully there we go we're at router 2 so config, config, config stayed and um, that's how you reset. So if you found this video useful then give it a thumbs up. If you've got any questions stick them below. Um, I'll stick a link to this so you can just copy and paste um, when you're doing it in the bottom in the description. Um, the plan is that I've just created this like this little blog thing to keep all the commands on the videos that I do or things useful where I'm running commands all the time just you can't always remember things so like the commands to install iOS from the TFTP server uh, a link to download TFTP uh, and also like I don't know installing lamp things like that that's I'm, I'm slowly adding to this um, so it's like my little personal uh, memory bank of commands and I'll add the things that I do in the videos to this as well so you can just when you're in your putty you can just copy it and then you can just paste it in and then run it and then you don't actually have to sit there and type everything you can just copy it off um, so yeah if, if you like the video give it a thumbs up Got any questions leave them below and I'll see you guys in the next video.